So I know that I took you through our master bedroom. So I wanted to bring you upstairs in our bunk room again. Um, and I wanted to kind of talk to you about some things. So this room was added on that we took half of our storage room and made a bunk room out of it. And so um, we just went on a trip to Blue Ridge, Georgia, and we found these super cute hand carved fish to put in here. And uh, so my husband had to have those. So, uh, I thought that was really cute hanging on the foot of the bed. And then I've got my little Santa Claus with my cooler. And all of my coolers in here are antique. This is one of my daddy's old thermos bottles. And so, this right here is a old um, radio flyer wagon. And uh, I bought that from Vintage Goat down in Pace, Florida. And then Alan had, my husband, had this super cute uh, dark board, and I added that in here. This room is just a fun room. We've got all kinds of knickknacks in here, Americana. Uh, he made me a lamp out of an old thermos bottle, and I'm, I'm collecting thermoses slowly but surely. I'm getting those. So over each bed, I have uh, a set of skis, and I used one on either side. And I put that there, uh, added some little Christmas in the plaid, my American flag that I picked up here in Andalusia. Um, and then, you know, you've already seen all my thermoses. But we just kind of sprinkled in some Christmas items more for um, the girl to take pictures today. So, um, I'm excited to see all those pictures. Low Key Customs made me a super cute pillow. She does such a good job. Y'all need to look her up. And I added some ornaments to my little tree up here. So, I'll show you what they are. I painted these little bobbers, and you can see I added little sticks with marshmallows on them, and I thought they were so cute. So I added those. So um, I'm thinking about showing a video of painting ornaments and painting things. So I, I wanna do that, but I just kinda wanted y'all to see what I did. So these two ornaments are made on the exact same cutout. So I've got a bobber, and I have a little um, thermos. Just like the real one on the bottom, I did thermoses. I thought they were so cute. But anyway, I had fun doing this little tree for the kids. But I added more to it, and I wanted y'all to see that. And then this goes into this. There's a door here we had to use for our storage on the other side. We just put that here. And then um, there's our little closet area. And I've got all the grandbaby stockings. All the grandbabies. We have eight grandchildren. Eight. And this is an old desk that I have. I love collecting old items. Little fishing basket. Um, I just kind of wanted to show y'all more in depth. I know that I showed you the, um, the whole house. But I wanted to kind of get back on here and show everything so you could see it. This is a piece that I have made. I ordered the Adirondack Mountains picture off of Etsy, bought a very simple frame, and then I took and added all of this around it to make it bigger. And I thought that turned out really cute. So pan back around. I've got my little Christmas trucks and my Christmas pillows, my Christmas plaid. So everything's super, super cute. Let y'all see that over there. Looks really good. But but we are going to do a video. Uh, we have some pictures of the process of us building this room. I did the floors. I whitewashed the walls. Everything in here. Every piece in here my husband and I touched. And we enjoyed it. We, um, we fought a little bit. But, you know... It was fun. We, we really are very tickled with this room. So I just kind of wanted to hop on here once again and show you little special touches we added for our photographer to come today. And uh, I just, I love sharing everything with y'all. And I just wanted to give you a more in-depth look of everything. Oh, oh, oh. These are pieces of fence, fencing. The simple fencing that you buy and then I bought those round wooden ornaments these came in a, a funky shape and I thought that looks like a snowman 
glued them onto the piece of wood, made him a little, um, I had some of my grandmother's old buttons and I just made him a little scarf. How easy is that? I love it. All right, guys. I get, I gave you another little sneak peek of things that I've added. Y'all have a good day.